What's up guys, back with another video. So here it is. I'm going to show you the car that I got. Um, I love this car. I've had it for about three months now and I just enjoy it. Um, yeah, I had some options to get a, a Challenger and a Charger, but Challenger wasn't obviously practical with three kids. Um, and then also the Charger, I didn't really like any of the, um, the options I really had. Um, so what I decided to do was I was going to get this car now and then when I pay this car off, maybe get another car for myself. Um, but here's the car. Here is the 2013 Dodge Dart Limited Edition. Um, so right here, I already kind of did this myself. I um, th Those things right here used to be all chrome. I made them black. And then right here was chrome. And where you see the black by the license plate right here, that was all red um, when I originally got it. But I painted it with a like plexi dip for now and then we'll see how it look and yeah on the first day I got it some butthole freaking hit that with their door but that is going to be fixed uh soon we have the whole side here we got the nice chrome handles nice little alloy rims so you can obviously see in the back i already took off the dart i took off the limited and i took off the dealership stickers this does have the backup camera this car is amazing on gas sounds awesome and then at nighttime this right here there's like a little light underneath here that will light up the hole underneath the car so I can see and then we also have the blinkers on the side these are heated Let's step into the car itself right here we have the gas button if I press that the gas door will open and if I press this right here, the trunk will open. So let's go check that out. This trunk is nice and spacious. Very spacious. You put a lot of stuff in here. I have a jumper and a trickle charger. Over there is the car seats for the kids. I put them out so you guys can see the car. Let's get to the back seat. Yeah, it might be a little messy. Sorry about that. I had car seats in here. I do have my caliber um, floor mats in here for now um, until I get some uh, weather techs. So here we go. We have a nice leather seats back here, little area. Pull that. There's a little cubby right here, cup holders. Press this little button. You can see back in the trunk where we were just at. And also if we pull this little tab right here, the whole thing will go down but we don't need that right now all right so also at this also has leds right here so all the handles light up on all four corners the cup holders right here all four corners those all light up let's see the gas cap right here so right when you get need to get gas you undo this and then you have a little hook just hook it right up on there so you don't scratch up the car and yes, I did buy this used, and you could tell that somebody didn't use it because there's a couple minor scratches from the gas cap. But I'm gonna get those uh, touched up, make it look nice. But let's get back into the cabin, and I'll show you guys my front seat here. So this is all electric uh, seating. This is a lumbar support. Um, you got fog lights, you have all the little things that you need. Shut the door. It's a little windy outside. All right, now I'm going to start her up. All right, so here we have the big display, 7 inches. And if I want to, I can make it to that speedometer. But obviously, we like it better as that. Um, turn left. Turn right. This thing is really freaking awesome. We have my big screen right there. If I put that in reverse, we have the reverse camera. We have XM radio, which I'm gonna turn that off real quick. We can have my uh, Samsung phone right there. We have heated seats, both sides, heated steering wheel. Um, also this right here, has like a little sensor right here and also 
if someone has their high beams on i won't get blinded by the light if you come back over here we have climate control navigation and then obviously the phone control which i don't have my it connected because i have the bluetooth off and then we also have the regular controls if you want to control these and then you have regular little plug this is um automatic but i still use the e-brake because it's good for your transmission um and here we have another plug sd card slot usb cord aux and then right there we have a cd player which is awesome and then over here we have the big glove department here you have your little manuals you have a paper clip here we have um, the pen holder and that thing goes way back there and then also in this seat is like a little secret compartment where you pull this tab right here and I just keep all my straws knives and napkins from different uh, restaurants there um, touch that off and also if I use my GPS it will tell me right on here when I got to take a left how much miles it is until I take a left it's freaking awesome. I'm gonna see if I can show you guys that um, later on in the video, but I'm gonna quickly pop the hood and let's go check out that engine. All right, so now we're at the engine. Let's pop the hood. A nice, beautiful 2.0 liter. A nice big battery. All nice and clean. This thing runs like the top. Got the alternator going there. It needs probably some washer fluids in here but that's probably about it I haven't done that yet but she runs really 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 good yeah I do need to give her a little wash we had a lot of pollen coming down all right so now guys I have the GPS going and I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like on here all right so now we're in reverse But as you can see right here it says 0.4 miles take a left so that's what I like about this it's almost like a heads-up display and it tells you right here where you got to go and it still tells you your miles per hour right on top so it's a win-win situation and right here we have the sunroof sunroof is pretty awesome this is my sunglass holder this is where my nice ray bands will go I have uh, the garage door opener also right here um, let's make sure nothing, none of my addresses and shit is showing because that's my registration and insurance. And got there my oil change. And on the other side, it's the same thing. It has a nice little paper clip holder right there built in. And then you got a nice little mirror. But that's pretty much the new car, man. You know, I pretty much showed you everything. Thank you guys for watching. Um, checking out my new car. I definitely love it and here's me driving the speed limit is only 35 don't do that at home <laughs> but I was just trying to show you this shit gets up and goes this thing is nice and quick I love this car so let me just turn the camera around for one minute All right so hope you guys did enjoy that video I fucking love this car um, definitely a lot better than any other car I've had before in the past and you know you've guys seen my first uh, car I've ever put on this channel which was the red Dodge Caliber, that was a stick shift. And then the second Dodge Caliber, which was an automatic, my brother crashed it, I got rid of it, I got this new car. I love it, and hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And remember, I'm doing a giveaway, guys. Um, I'm gonna be doing two Amazon gift card giveaways on this channel, and um, I'm gonna be doing a Disney gift card on my Disney uh, YouTube channel. 
So, peace.